going to solve the 2009 AP Environmental Science free response question. So the math on this question starts with C. On your paper, I did not include A and B, but those would be non-math problems. So let's go ahead and start with C. Assuming the cost of electricity remains constant and the farmer starts using the manure from the cows in an anaerobic digester to produce electricity on the farm, calculate the number of kilowatt hours of electricity that can be produced in one year. So we need to look at our givens and figure out what we want to use. So we have 500 cows, and in the givens it says that each, cows, each cow produces 3 kilowatt hours per day, but it asked us in a year, so you need to know that there's 365 days per year. And then you're going to get the kilowatt hours per, um, per year. This is cows day, cows per day. And so our days cancel, our cows cancel, and we're going to get kilowatts per year. So off to the side, you're going to be, need to do your math. Make sure that you set it up horizontally, but you can solve it vertically. So pause the video and go ahead and solve. 500 times 3, that's easy, 1,500. And then you need to solve times 365. All right, so when you have solved this by hand, your answer comes out to be 547,500 kilowatt hours per year. All right, going on to C2 or CII, So one of the things that is nice about the AP test is that if you have to use an answer to one question into the next question, if you get the answer wrong to CI and you have to use it in CII, then if you have a wrong answer but you use the wrong answer correctly in CII, then you can get points for CII. So we have to use this answer because it asks for how much money the farmer is saving in a year. And so the amount of electricity produced is this number. And then we need to multiply it times 10 cents per kilowatt hour. to get our answer in dollars. But let's say for the last problem, you came up with some wacky number like uh, 597,500. But if you use this wrong answer and you used it correctly and you got an answer that was um, a correct answer using this number, you would still get points for CII. Well, this is the wrong answer, um, so I'm just going to go ahead and erase it. And now we're just going to solve it using the blue ink up here. And I have a mistake up there. So <clears throat> we're just going to take this number and multiply it by 0.1, like that, because that's what this is. And when I do that, I end up with a dollar amount. 54,750. It said you can round up to the nearest whole thousand. So if you left it at this, they gave you points that year. If you rounded it to this, they also gave you points. So either one would give you points. But when you round it, that's better because you need it for the next problem. C3. 
The amount of time in years that it will take to recover the cost of installing an anaerobic digester on the farm. And so you need to calculate the amount of time in years. So the cost of our aerobic digester from the prompt, it cost 400000 to install. And every year, the farmer saves 55000 This is why they asked you to round. So it would be a nice, easy problem instead of a harder problem to do without a calculator. Once again, let's say you got a wrong answer in the last problem because you this is this 55,000 is the answer from CII. If that answer was wrong, but you used it in this problem and you used it correctly and got a correct answer for that problem, like you did the math right, then you would get the answer and the points for CIII. So again, no double jeopardy. So when I go ahead and solve this, and I can cross out, let's see, one, two, three zeros here, so I can cancel one, two, three zeros here, and I can go ahead and do my long division by hand. Here's my decimal, bring it up, add a zero. My remainder is 15, I'm gonna drop it down to here. This goes in twice, two times 55 is 110. My remainder is 40, add a zero, drop it down. This goes in, it looks like seven times, but it asks me that I can round up. And so, I can already know that I can round to seven, and so it's gonna take seven years. Um, by the way, this was 55,000 per year. And so the answer is 7.2 or 7.3, and then I can round it to seven years. So the math on this, again, was not particularly hard. The hardest, the actual math itself was not hard. The hardest part is figuring out what to, how to set up the problem from the words.